Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Unicorn Overlord. I am back from my vacation. It was a very fun time, definitely, definitely needed. Uh, I did just wake up basically the day this <laughs> this video was going up to record it, so uh, very, very worn out. I think I collectively drove 14 hours uh, over the past like two days. So uh, yeah, very worn out. We'll probably have to be a 30 minute episode today just while I kind of get back into the groove of things. But, uh, we'll see what we can go ahead and, uh, get done here. So... What do I want to do? I remember... We were hanging out over here, obviously. I was messing with the Colosseum last time, so... I remember doing a bunch of stuff down here, and this is walled off, I do remember that. that. So, we we're gonna go up here... To Izveda. And, uh, see what we can do over here. Why not? Hello. What's going on? Listen up, vermin. We've gotten word that a resistance elf by the name of ethelian has been spotted in this very town. Nobody comes in or out until we found him. Please, sir, this must be some kind of misunderstanding. My citizens are frightened enough as is. Let's quit your sniveling, mayor. If we find that rat, it'll be your head that rolls for it. Ah, ah, yes, yes, the thing where, like, basically an area is being occupied and they're just gonna take it out on the residents if they can't find the person that they want to find. Good old witch hunt. Pardon the intrusion, my prince, but would you permit me to visit the cemetery? Due to her advanced age, blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and check out the cemetery. Neat, neat. You have my deepest thanks. Cool. Uh, hi, no, stay away from me. Stay away. Stay away. I'm talking to somebody. Went to the woods to play, but when I came back, the whole town was locked up. Now that mean soldier won't let me in. Just who are you supposed to be? Sorry, but the town's not taking visitors. Okay. This is bad. My stomach's twisting in knots over here. I don't know how much longer I can hold it. I just want to go home. Okay, some of these do have multiple things to say. Don't think I'm going to make it. Fairies of the Divine Tree, I beg you. Deliver Sir Athelion from danger. Oh, it's okay. I, I got I got Athelion. This is quite the mess you've gotten us into, Alina. Oh, there, please. Sir Athelion is a hero. Quite unlike you and the other cowards who rolled over the moment Zenoira marched into town. Oh, tell him, Alina! Don't you see he's fighting for the good of Elheim? These people need him. We need him. I know that I do, but there's nothing to be done. We lack the strength to oust even one soldier, let alone all of Zenoira. Hmm. I can't turn a blind eye to the plight of these villagers. Yeah, no, we definitely can't. I mean, I'm- I'm- it, it's very, very awful, and obviously I feel for your circumstance, because yeah, you want to protect yourself and your village, and you clearly don't have the means to win, but uh, luckily we're here to help. What am I to do? It's a rough decision. Dare point your sword at me, I'll make you pay for that rebel sympathizer. <laughs> there you go. Ugh, never stood a chance. Damn right. Such incredible strength. Forgive me the question, but who are you? This man is Elaine, leader of Cornea's Liberation Army. Lady Rosalinda. Oh, thank the Father, you're safe. Tell me, is a Thilion here? Well, we found him wounded not long ago and gave him shelter so he might recover. But he departed soon thereafter so as not to put us in harm's way. Much good that did you. In any case, it appears the enemy has deployed search parties for him. The Leon needs us, Elaine. Indeed, and I'm not about to abandon him to his fate. We take the field at once. The Elven Knight! I did want one of these classes. Thanks for getting rid of that soldier, mister. I can finally go home again because of you. You're welcome. I beg you, Sir Elaine. The people of this town save the people of this town from Zenora's brutality. I will. Oh, praise the heavens. I just barely made it in time. Hey, there we go. Okay, we got Breakers, Elven Fencers, and Legionnaires. I imagine this class is an Elven Fencer, which I wanted. The mayor's daughter, Elena, was sheltering Athelion, a leader in the Elheim Resistance. But he fled in order to save the town from danger. Unwilling to let him die, the Liberation marches forward to rescue him. Marches forth. Alright. The Elven Knight. Whoa, you're cool looking. They just keep coming, and 
our arrows grow ever fewer. Oh. So cool. We'll never survive at this rate. What's the weird thing you're doing with your hands? <laughs> you look like a you look like a JoJo character posing right now. Don't give up hope just yet. Steal your resolve and strike true. Well, you seem cool. Nice spandex as well. All right. Ooh, it's actually a very big battlefield. Our objective of this battle is none other than rescuing Athelion. Thankfully, it looks like he's already headed our way. After them now! Uh-oh. Still, they persist. Make haste, everyone. We find our way through this, no matter what it takes. Okay. Let me speak with him, Elaine. He'll be sure to join our cause as long as I'm there to talk him into it. Okay, cool. You're in my group anyway, so... Ooh. Yeah. Okay. We do need to get over there to you. Which is going to be kind of a struggle. But we have seen in one of those other missions... Well, no, uh, you know, I was going to say we've seen in one of those other missions where I had to protect a target that was far off. They, like, didn't actually try to kill them. But that was specifically a trap, so... Hmm. Yeah, look, look at your little animation where you just angrily stare at your hand and clench it. <laughs> I like the outfit, though. The outfit's very cool. Uh, ooh. Hello. Ah! Ooh, it would be fun to make use of that. Okay, so what do we have? We have some Wyvern Knights. We have some Cavalry. We have quite a few Legionnaires. What I saw... Well, there, there's two right there. There's more right here. That is... Interesting. A two-person squad to guard the fort? There's... Whoa, in the watchtower? Can they provide assist? Oh, is it like a... Yeah, yeah, I guess it's like a leaven sword kind of thing. Can they... Huh, they might be able to do assist. Yeah, it can provide magic assist for allied units right down there in the bottom left. Thought I would check. Hmm. Okay, that's worth noting. This class seems cool. Uh, yeah, and then Lightning Blade. Inflict Stun. Remove weakness, remove the user's debuffs, grant the user a buff to evade one attack. Ooh. And allow an ally to evade one attack. Activate support. Oh my god, that's super cool. Oh, this class is neat. Yeah, it's all about... Like, you can use this on the person in the front line that's tanking just in case they get debuffed or low HP so they can evade one attack. And then you can- this just activates if one of your allies in the back line gets hit by a ranged attack. Ah, oh, that's super cool. What a neat class. Okay. But here, it definitely seems like we have a lot of infantry, so I'll probably be running over a lot of these with, um... My cavalry squad. And then I'm definitely gonna want some flyers and stuff in. Alright, I'll, uh, work on some squads here. Don't know how much I'm gonna need to edit them, but... Alright, uh, I think I've been messing around with the parties enough. Uh, I changed basically just a lot of equipment around. I didn't change too many of the characters. But, uh, <clears throat> I did add Leah to this party because we have some characters that have high evasion. And both of my Swordmasters, uh, or Leia and Aramis are both pretty, pretty low level currently. So, I have Leia in the front, with a Vitality Talisman Lapis Pendant. Um, we do have Impale now, which is attack a single enemy, grants the user plus one PP if the target is defeated. Um, didn't change anything about Travis. Uh, didn't change anything about you. I did put Linalagos in, just because you were also kind of low level. And I gave you the Pursuance Bracelet, so you can help with people. Also, you have the Selfless Heal, where when you get healed, you restore HP to allies, which is cool. You can also remove debuffs, so, uh, that's a neato team. And Travis is in because there's, once again, not a lot of characters in this battle that can actually hit him, so. That is useful. Uh, this squad didn't really change too much. Um, I think all I did was give Ocles the barbed ribbon, because those, uh, fencers can stun. So, uh, that is a thing. Uh, I actually did want to make one change here. Uh, I want to take Gloucester out and put Miriam in instead, because we do have some some magic users to deal with here. And Miriam's lower level anyway, so it'll uh, it'll help. 
So that's good stuff. Um, <clears throat> as far as this team goes, didn't really make many changes, but I did look into Celeste because she's a new named character, and she's interesting for a Griffin Master. Um, as you can see there, her growth types are defensive and hardy, which was already, I was like, huh, that's interesting. So this is definitely a Griffin Master that you want to put in the front row. Um, and to make things even more interesting, uh, Labrys, her axe, gives plus five initiative and 20% guard rate, which guard rate is not very common on a Griffin Master. So uh, I put you in the front row, uh, buffed your evasion a pretty good amount, and stuff, and I'm kind of just going to make you like an off tank for, for Lex here. And Lex can protect you with arrow cover if you if you need it as well. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that is, uh, I think that was good. So, all that's going on. I, I did upgrade them to the green, green berets, so. I uh, didn't mess with this team at all. I don't even know if I'll use them, if I'm going to be completely honest. If I need to take out the, uh, uh, legionnaires, I might. But uh, we do have some magic damage on these other characters to help us out with that. Uh, and then last is a lane team where I basically just put Aramis in and I uh, gave him the King's Blade Cornix, which is the all stats plus five thing. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, most of the rest of the stuff is just upgrading various characters equipment and all of that. So alrighty. Uh, let's go ahead and oh shit. How can I assist? It's been a few days since I've actually touched this. Um, I want Miriam to be the leader. Let's just check my other leaders real quick, too, while I'm uh, thinking about it. Travis, reduce wait time while resting. HP and stamina faster. Healing assist, range assist. We'll, we'll, put, we'll put you on Linolagos. Um, uh, you, ranged assists. That looks good. You, definitely Lex, less damage from ranged assists. Lane should be the leader at all times, and yeah, okay, I think we're good now. So uh, let's go ahead and send them out here. By your command. So they're going to go ahead and take care of that. Uh, I need to send a group down there to take that. Lex's group... Let's see, what do I want them to do? They wouldn't be very effective at dealing with the Legionnaire, but they could kind of fly over and take out like these characters and such. They will kind of get messed up though, that's... Yeah, that's like, that's like a squad that either... I don't even know if Travis could deal with it. Probably, probably uh, Hodrick would have to deal with that one. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna send the flyers out just to just to see. We also do need to get. Um, that's what the flyers can do. The flyers can go and provide support to uh, you over there until we can get a lane down there. And I'll go ahead and deploy a lane as well. So I'll just have the flyers just swoop in, take out the characters that I think they can handle. Um, possibly target like these fencers since they're in the since they're in the thing over there. So let's just uh let's just see there. Oh wait, I do have Lex as the leader. Yeah, so you're not gonna be nearly as fast. I mean I could just You're not gonna be able to fly over things, but we can we can still buff you to move faster. So mm. But yeah, I should probably I should probably withdraw you and just set you as one of the other ones. Uh, all right. But boom. Yeah, cause just being able to fly is such a powerful ability. Maybe I'm like over prioritizing it. Okay, that is that is an Elaine fight right there. The path is set. Have you needed me? So you're gonna chill. Sorry. There's some people in the forest currently coming for us. Uh, alright. Let's change you, Lex. Let's have Celeste be the leader. Okay. Celeste unit. Good. And I'm also going to have you... Ooh, it would have been cool to get everyone, but that's good enough. 
There we are. Okay, so what are you? We can probably still take them. It's kind of annoying, but... We can still take them. We are just going to take some damage fighting them. Uh, I don't suppose you would do any better. No, not really. Alright, so we're going to try to just get you down here. To help out with things. Ooh, actually... Your villainy ends here. I shall not yeah, we're gonna me. let um we're gonna let Elaine's group fight them. Probably because of the magic helping with the yeah. Uh, so the sword masters are still alive, but that's fine. And how do you fare fight. now? Now you destroy them. And then we just continue March. to allow Elaine to Onward. go take care of this. There we are. Ends here. Good. We will be hurt a little bit, but we're fine. Uh, now the only thing I hate here is that I'm being attacked by you. So I think actually rather than attack that unit while they're weak, I'm going to run over there and take out the elven fencers. So, bye bye. Good, good. According to plan. There we go. We are getting we are getting reduced XP on them. So. Uh, I kind of wanted them for cracking things open here, but we're not going to need to over-rely on them, I would say. But probably once we get, like, an actual fort, like, over here, I might swap them out. Um, for now, though, they can chill. Let's see. Okay. We do need to get over there. Holy shit, though, you're doing a very, very good job. Let's see you in action, why don't we? Struck down. Such a crazy edgy pose. Yeah, these these poor legionnaires don't know what uh, don't know what's hitting them. Oh, that's so cool. What a neat unit. I'm gonna like you, I think. Oh my god, look at that. I need your strength. Yeah, they're just such a cool unit and a, like a good support unit as well. Also, they're all like, you know, basically pre... I, I say like pre-upgraded basically because they're already like they're... They already have two uh, it's AP and uh, PP, which is quite nice. There we go. Cool units. I really, really do like those. Okay. Uh, we do need to get over there to them still, though, like I mentioned. Uh... Bye-bye. <coughs> That's taken care of. Good. I've yet a long way to climb. No complaints here. There we are. And, yeah, now I just need to get over to them. Like, ASAP. Uh... Down here. We can take out this fort. I'm not worried. They're gonna push through. I feel like I recognize that voice actor. For sure. Uh... You face me. There we go. We are good. Fine bout. We can cap this. For the liberation. Mine now. Got my stamina back. Okay, and we can work on deploying some additional units here. <clears throat> like, uh... Travis's unit wouldn't be terrible. But not against, not against them. Oof, there's actually two groups of Legionnaires. Travis's group would do a good job taking them out. The time is at hand. Uh... And we have these crews down here. How well do you fare against them? Oof. You hurt. What would you ask uh, this group can take them out pretty easily. And then we can just send you after them. You should get to them before they wake up. Damn, Delph. How's he made it all the way here? Give chase, men. We can't let him escape. Better hurry. Mm, don't want you getting hit by that. So we're gonna... We're gonna let you avoid that. Bye-bye. I'm glad that enemies can't swap out with party members next to them. It's such an OP ability for me to have in particular. 
Uh, yeah, you're dead. Okay, and then let's just go up here. This should be quick. Cool. Done. My Griffin will get a treat for this. Oh, that's a cute line. <laughs> Hello. There you go. Athelion. Is that you, Terrace? Calms my heart to see you safe. Tell me, what of Suntuka? Freed at the hands of Elaine in the Liberation. Everyone there seemed quite worried about you. Thank you, Sir Elaine, truly. Now the enemy general marches from that town over there. Lend me your aid in cutting her down, and together we'll restore peace to this region once and for all. Hey! Cool. Follow any order you wish to give, Sir Elaine. Let our voices ring clear and our blades strike true. Elven Fencer. Elven Fencers use magic melee attacks to strike at their enemies with superlative finesse. Okay. Uh, there's this that I would like you to take care of, but what is what is all this then? <clears throat> hmm. We're gonna have to deal with some of that as well. Bye bye. I'm feeling like you're probably gonna fare better because you have so much magic damage than I would, so. Go ahead and attack them. Uh. This. Have you need of me? We do. Okay. We do We do take a fair bit of damage there. But I think I'll let you take, all, take out that garrison. And you. I want to come down here and help with these things. Because there are a lot of enemies working their way towards us. And I'll probably just withdraw this crew after they get this this win here. Uh, just because they're low on stamina and I would prefer to allow some other people to get XP. Since they're getting reduced XP right now. I mean XP isn't like the craziest thing that I need to worry about for sure. But it still feels helpful to get the XP on the right characters here. Hello. Your villain <clears throat> ends here. My Magical assist? No. Don't want it. There you go. Good, good. Okay, and you... Basically, the plan I have for you is sending you over here, because you're the only unit that can reach the Cyclone, and then I can send it after some of like, these units and stuff. <clears throat> which will probably be quite helpful. Actually, I might also send this unit down here to grab that item, too. We could also take out you the scouts. Which could be nice. Bye-bye. <coughs> Beautiful. And... Dead. Bunch of healing. Might I rest a moment? Wait, what? Oh my god, it survived to 3 HP. Oh my, oh my okay. Not expected. Um, let's just have you rest. And... Let's use uh, an hourglass on you. Just so you can get back into action fairly quickly. Yeah, I didn't realize that that uh, legionnaire lived with like a small amount of HP left still. Okay. And Elena is going to be trapped in the... Uh, <clears throat> in the thick of it over here. With... Uh, Little, little stamina, but it's going to be Your fine. Since we can actually fight back as long as I don't rest. I just can't go out of my way rest. to attack. What is it? So... I'll handle it. I'm kind of surprised that having low stamina like that doesn't, um... Like, I mean, maybe it, maybe it does and I just don't realize, but it doesn't, like, reduce your unit's stats if they're fighting while exhausted. My legs grow heavy. I mean, not being able to move is itself a pretty pretty rough uh, nerf but still there we go we're holding this area quite well I would say uh, as soon as you get over here we can actually camp so that is nice but we're we're holding this area off super super well right now and I have so many Valor points to work with at the moment as well. I'll show you what I can do. All right. Good stuff. I'm not worried. Bye bye. Yeah, these these nerds are getting cleaned up. I need to rest. We are cleaning house right now. All right. So. Ooh. Yeah, they weren't going to fare well 
Come then. Yeah, that's what we need. Once we get Aramis in there, he he he. Eat it. God, this is so OP. Just just being able to do this. <clears throat> These units are exhausted, but they're basically just sitting here holding this one choke point. There you go. Now we're good. What would you have me do? Uh We can take out this squad. Hello. Not completely take them out, mind, but... There we go. Now they're dead. Thanks to the magic assist. Oh, I should have seen what the magic assist looked like for them. Because we've seen, like, fireballs raining in and stuff. I wonder if theirs is, like, lightning. That would be cool. Alright, so... How about... Since I have so many valor points at the moment. How about we drop a fresh hasten call on all of us? And we fly down here to the Divine Cyclone and pray. Die. Good stuff. Easy enough. Okay. You go over there, finish that. Uh, I have to actually have you go in and finish that little unit off. Wait till I tell Liza about this. Bastard's Cross. Attack a single enemy. Potency increased based on target's HP. Oh no. Is this a... What does that mean? Does it mean based off of the target's low or high HP? Attack a single enemy. Potency increases based on target's HP. Maximum increase plus 60. It hits twice... I mean, either way, it's good, but I'm wondering if it's like straight up an ability that just, that like does more damage to targets that are currently healthy. Potency increases based on targets' HP, because yeah, it doesn't say if it's like based off of like all oh, if they're low health or something like that. Okay, okay, so I looked it up. It is what I thought. I found a I found a Reddit thread basically talking about it. And someone said, based off of this unit kicking my ass in the Colosseum, I believe it's based off of their current HP. So the higher their current HP is, the more damage you do. And then someone else kind of confirmed that. So yeah, you want to target enemies with the highest percent HP with that attack, it seems. So that's cool. That's like a, that's like a tank destroyer. That would absolutely annihilate gladiators. Um, so... I definitely want it to prioritize, uh, Killing Chain. Um, most of all, I would say, like, for this one, Combatant type, like, Armored Combatants? I, I guess, no, like, enemy enemies with high HP, like, highest HP, I guess? The only problem is if, if it's like a, you know, like a legionnaire or something, they'll just guard it. But we'll, we'll put it as highest HP. So... <clears throat> that's such a... Mm, I don't know, though. I don't know. Though. I feel like that's one I would want to enable in certain circumstances. But sometimes not, you know what I mean? Like, when I'm fighting just, like, generic enemies, I, I want the killing chain to keep going, and you clearly do enough damage to be able to kill things. This would use all of your PP in one go, and, like, yes, you would probably be able to kill a gladiator, or, like, a, a, uh, the, the, the class Lexus, a fighter, pretty easily, but... <clears throat> yeah. Hmm. I guess... It says armored... I, see, the thing the thing I wish is there was, like, a tank. And, like, I guess that's armored, but, like, is a gladiator considered armored? They're not armored. They don't even guard well. They just have a ton of HP. And in, like, Lex's class, is that considered a armored unit? I'm gonna... Mm, we'll, we'll, we'll find out. That might, that might be something we're gonna have to investigate, too. Because there's a lot of things like that that the game doesn't tell you that you kind of just have to feel your way through. It almost feels like it would be better just to have Killing Chain and Heavy heavy Slash on, if I'm going to be honest. Um, 
so we'll stick with that for now but yeah there, there's there's some questions I have about that for sure hello I'm here to take your life I blossom ever brighter you do Miriam you're great what would you ask of me all right garrison in there that is ours now beautiful have you need of me and you ride over here get that item there's no other items back here I'm missing right Hiccup. What a terrible time for the hiccups. Okay. Uh, come on. To me. Let's go. Time to go. And I guess you can come along too. Okay. <clears throat> Obviously, don't want you fighting that one group. I found something. Ooh, ten k. Thank you. Come uh, dead. Honestly, I don't even know if I'm really gonna have the opportunity to summon the Impressive. cyclone. I'm kind of rolling over these enemies pretty easily at the moment, so... Uh... You know, we should... We should do this, just because I'm maxed out. Excellent. Hello. Bye-bye. Let's, uh, do that. There you go. Work your way over there. While I collect some items. And possibly rest and stuff. Good. Yet a long way to climb. You Come sure do, Armus. Alright, so we can take a quick nappy. Uh, you can come down here. And that cyclone's gonna go mess them up. Miracle fruits. Okay, so yeah, that, that unit's gonna get they're gonna get messed up. This will come in handy. By the cyclone. What now? Uh, what I can do. you rest too, now that we've grabbed that. Because that cyclone's not going away for a minute, so... Okay, there it is, it's gone. Uh... Ooh, we kind of get messed up. Uh, I kind of want to send your group in there to Time deal. To you know, let, let's use let's use one of the hourglasses. It's not super needed. I actually might have had... Uh, distance swap... Quick impetus. I was gonna say I might have had one of the things that uh, you know, um, like speeds up. What did, what are your valor what skills, by the way? Rain lightning on a position and damage all enemy units within range. Ooh. And then yeah, the merciful rain. That's fun. Uh. Okay. Get an. Oh, okay. They die super hard. I was kind of hoping maybe they wouldn't. But, uh, no, they die. They die super hard. I want to get you in there, though, just to see if you have anything to say. Uh, can I...? Not quite. I will summon some archers, so we have some backup here. There we are. And get in there. So, how much damage do we do? My strength is with you. Okay, we actually win if I do that. My strength is we actually win if I do that, but <clears throat> I do want to see if this unit has something to say to them. Uh, so, eh. Let's see what they have to say to Elaine. How have they so swiftly repelled our advance? They shall learn what becomes of those who defy Zenoira. If you say so. Okay, so yeah, this is why we get kind of messed up. That is also going to hurt a lot. Yeah, we are smacking on a tank with, uh, yeah. I should have got Rosalinda's, uh, stuff up. That breaker is about to... <laughs> Sorry, Elaine. Just watching the character ominously buff in the back <clears throat> was terrifying. Okay. Magic missile does hurt. Healing you. Yeah, I don't. I don't even know if we're gonna. Well, yeah, you can. You have the damage to do so. Predictable. Predictable. Yeah, that guard. Ah, <laughs> all those breakers. 
Not enough AP for Bastard's Cross, but we can still do that. <clears throat> oh, that was a hilarious fight. Okay, so yeah, you 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 stand back now, Elaine. Let let them go in, and uh, take care of things, I suppose. Uh, a little bit annoying that you did um, that you did that to bring them back, because they're probably gonna super die now. So we're gonna we're gonna call that down really quick, and I'm also gonna give a valorous order to everybody. I'm pretty sure they'll be able to win now, but um. Time to go. Like, let's let's see what the comparison looks like now. Not quite actually, but if I stop them and let the 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 storm happen here, they should be able to win. And this way we can take out this final enemy as well. <clears throat> but I like uh, I like Athelion being the one that uh, finishes things off here. There you go. Can we win now? No. Yeah yeah. Eat that two damage. One more, one more proc what will actually. Let's see. Do I have something better to throw? Vexing indeed. Um. I mean, I could summon some warriors to bump into them. Uh. And then I think I'll summon like one more rainstorm. I just, I just want to kill that legionnaire, so we don't have to worry about it. I mean, it's not the biggest deal for this crew, I guess, but might as well use all of our valor points. Okay, they killed them. There we go, that's what we need. Yeah, get in there. Alright, and let's actually see the fight. I want to see if you say anything. This is payback. Yeah! <laughs> oh, sorry, Elvin Fencer. <laughs> it's okay, though, she's down. Good. Alright, that was a cool fight, and I definitely like this unit a whole lot. <clears throat> that free stun on that is fantastic as well. So. This is just the beginning. Yeah. Another step on the path of progress. This should help the cause. I mean, I don't think I get any of these units, so uh, that's cute, but um, don't need it. Ooh, a warrior's medallion. Those are nice. <laughs> Alrighty. We are good. Avarian Teras. I've put you through more trouble than I'm worth. Sir Athelion! And I'm sorry for making you worry, Alina. None of that, please. I'm just glad you're back in one piece. As am I. As you can see, they barely even put a scratch in my armor. Thank the heavens, yes. Pardon me, Lady Rosalinda, but what would you have us do now? The Liberation Army fights for justice not only for Cornea, but for all subjugated lands of Fevereth. And so, we will repay the blood they've spilt in our name by joining them in their cause. As you command. We are most grateful for the support. I assure you, such bravery will not go unrewarded. Yet I must say, a human settlement is one of the last things I was expecting to find in Elheim. They sought refuge here when your kingdom first fell. <sighs> Though, of course, we could only offer them the briefest respite before we too were overrun. And you, Ethelion, what do you plan to do now? As long as your star shines for the liberation, Teras, mine too shall shine with it. Yeah. Assuming you'll take me. There would be no greater honor. If I may, Sir Athelion. That character on the right, the like, the one that's slowly panning off the screen right now, is really staring at Athelion hard with some bedroom eyes. Once Zenora is defeated and the war is won, will you return to this town? To me? You've shown me greater kindness than I ever thought possible. But there is no foe more terrible than the one we face now. I won't make a promise I may not be able to keep. Yes, of course. Know then that I'll be praying for your safety. Just as I always have and just as I always will. Thank you, Elena. And may life treat you better than I have.
Yeah, cool new unit. I like you. You're neat. All right, good, good. Save progress. Yes, yes. So, alrighty. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more. <laughs>